we're going to talk about tanagrams or tangrams today. And each one of you is going to get a piece of colored construction paper with a tangram um, drawn on it. Now a tangram is a traditional Chinese puzzle made of a square, there's your big square, divided into seven pieces. There's one parallelogram, parallelogram, and five triangles and one square. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to cut out the square. And because I am making a video for you, I am trying to do my cutting a little bit quicker, but please take your time when it is your turn. Now, these puzzle pieces can be made out of cardboard. Um, you can even buy them. I have a set that is plastic that I bought. And it's just a fun, a fun puzzle. So now that I have my square cut, now I'm going to begin cutting out my other, my triangles, my parallelogram, and my square. And all of these are geometric shapes that I'm sure you'll be using sometime in math class. And of course in art we use geometric shapes and all sorts of shapes many times. So I'm going to throw out my scraps and I have my pile of puzzle pieces and you're also going to get a copy of some tangram um, objects that you can make. So I'm going to set that down too. Now all you're going to do at this point is try to do these puzzles. Try to create. You can start anywhere. Maybe I'll start with the dog. And I'm going to take my puzzle pieces here and here, there. You might have to figure some things out. It might not work the first time. I'm going to just show you here. Oh, his head is like a diamond. And then the smaller for the ear, right? And then the other small one for the back foot and the front. Hmm. I think I did it. Let me move my camera, okay? So there you have it. And I just tried the dog, and you can try all six. And then after you've tried the six, you can experiment and see if you can make something of your own. Today is just a practice. Um, so when you are done practicing, you're going to get a baggie, and you're going to put your tangram pieces in your baggie. And I will save them for you for next class because next time we're going to continue with tangrams and create a picture.